Alright, we are back. Uh, sorry for our technical malfunctions. Uh, let's continue on with the game, shall we? We now, shall. When we left off, you gentlemen were uh, doing a surprise round against these UNT. You've taken one down, and now you're back at the top of the round with Demort before everything went to haywire. Alright, I am going to use my blowgun for my primary attack. Alright. And it's... Let me make sure that I can range this. Its range is 25, so... 10, 20... Alright, so I need to move to here. And I will shoot this one. So it does 4 plus 1 base damage, and then 2d6 of poison damage, since I'm using the giant wolf spider man. Alright, so did you roll the attack? I'm doing that right now. That, does 11 hit? That is actually a dead on hit. Nice! So with so that... So they need a 9 con? Uh, and you're hitting the same one you already hit with the arrow earlier. Yes. And you notice when you hit him with it, the poison has no effect. Well, dang it. <laughs> <laughs> well, did you right. just use tea poison on a yon tea? <laughs> he did, on a snake creature. No, I used spider poison, thank you very much. <laughs> All right, and then I'm going to finish my movement to get close to him and do a flurry on him. No, I'm you not going to do a flurry. I'm just going to do an arm. You can't do it. You can't do an arm. It's a bonus action. Yeah, but you have to make a, uh, a melee, melee attack. No, not that's a need to use attack. flurry of blows. I can use my bonus action to do an unarmed strike. Oh, okay. Um, I thought that... Um, I you thought have to use, you have to use a, a monk melee. weapon for the first attack. Ah, okay. All That's right. if you're doing a flurry of blows. Right. Right. He did it in yeah. an attack. He can do an attack and still run in and do a martial yeah. arts. So give yeah, this is just a one on. strike. Yep, kick him in the nuts. Ah, missed him. And you were kicking at something, right. but it wasn't the Yonti. Yeah. They so have internal nuts. So he moved his him. tail. I missed it. So with that, Brother Mayai, you are now up. All right. Uh, let's see. We'll do that. On this gent right here. So I need deck save. All righty. Deck save it is. DC for that is going to be higher than a 8, I'm sure. Yes. Course, because it says 13 right there. Alright, so yep. he'll take the 8 points of damage. And that was your action? Yep. Uh, no one's been hit, so I will be done. Alright, so with that, it is now she. Alright. So the one that is on the other oh, the other side of me that is not down. Yep. I will go ahead and do my thing with do C, and then do my other thing without do C, and I offer you fifteen points of damage total if a twelve hits. Okay. 15 points, I will take your 15 points of damage. 12 does indeed hit. And I will shift right here. Actually, nope. Yeah, I'll stay right there. You sure? Yes, I am sure. Okie dokie. With that, it's uh, Vayer's turn. Alright. That's close enough. And on this guy. Alright. Wouldn't want to mess with cheese uh, karma. Oh, okay. So, I will take the first hit. 
or is it? And then the second, second one, I'll need a hundred, a uh, hundred percent, a uh, hundred dice. Ooh, shite! A D one hundred roll. Three. Ninety three is good. It heals them. Ninety three. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, give me fun. just a second to figure in the damage for your first hit, which was a successful hit. Oh, this isn't good. Okay, so you run in there and you fire off your first arrow. And just as you're about to fire off your second arrow, you slip. Your legs fall, uh, fly up from underneath you and you land flat on your back. You are now stunned. I'm not going to go for that long, but I'll say three rounds. Stunned and prone. Stunned wow. and prone. So cool. And you are unable to... Um, do a reaction for two of those rounds. It's like like something comes up and hits you and it moves away, that kind of deal. It's like a near fatal crit. You pretty much knocked the breath out of you and now you're gonna spend the next couple rounds getting it back. So with that it is there go. Alright, so any mini mini mo. Uh, it looks like she might be the bigger threat than a little halfling. I am quite little. Yeah. He's just a kid. An innocent so, kid. So, first of all, we will go to... Swing on the half lane. That's going to be an 18 to hit. Demort, 18 hits you? Yes, that hits me. Okay. Three points of damage for the first hit. And all right, three points of damage for the second hit. You got me good. I live. With that, the two on she first attempt. It's a negative. Okay, definitely a negative. God, Keep dog. rolling those negatives. All right, one. One hit, out of four one. swings. One hit. Uh, what does it? What does it roll? It was a twenty-two total. It does not hit me. All right, so you cast shield. I did cast shield. All right, so to give you an idea of the rolls that I had, it was a three and a one, a two and a one, a two. <laughs> I mean, you right, can so keep rolling like that all night. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change dice out if it keeps it up. All right, so with that, that was their go. Uh, Sarge, you're next. Sergeant Rock does not like this guy picking on the little kid. He's going to go in here where he's got a good bead on this guy here, move the hex onto him, and plug him with a couple with a hollow point round. So just to make sure I heard that correctly, Sergeant Rock does like that two are bang, ganging up on somebody else. He's like he, He's okay with that. But he doesn't care about that. It's just yeah. a little kid, you know? I got I got you. He can get beat up, but I'm so worried about hitting the kid that I just fire around into the air. <laughs> I yell at this guy. Okay, you fire yeah. off your your uh, your Eldritch Blast there and almost take the ear off. So that was you at five. Eat so my, start on my move. Go ahead. I finish up my movement right there. That's it. Copy that. Next up Copy is order. Demort. You are face to face with this thing. He's hit you twice, and don't know how much damage that would have uh, actually caused you, the two three points of damage. But it's on you. They were glancing blows. All right, I'm going to hit him with my Lequa. Uh, no, I won't. Nope, that didn't work. And I'll hit him with an unarmed strike as well. Alright. No, I won't. Okay, so pretty much what it's almost he like... He me. It, it looks like maybe he's grabbed the top of your head and is holding your way and you're swinging at him. <laughs> <laughs> so with that, it is... Um, Brother I May bite I. his hand. Next round. Alright. The same guy as last. Uh, DC okay. 13. Alright, I rolled a 16. So, he makes a save? Yep. Oh. 
Everybody looks all right, right? Uh, that'd be a question for the little man. I'm the only one that's been hit, but I'm fine. Okay. Then I will end my turn. Okay, so with that, that was uh, she. You're now. Uh, yes, the wash, rinse, repeat. Um, so I offer a 23 and a an 8. So against the guy that I've already hit, so the 8 will miss four points of damage. My polearm button does more damage than my actual quarterstaff. All right. Uh, he takes the hit. They're the same, right, in reality? No, one's a 1d6 and the other one's a 1d4. The polearm mm -hmm. button's a 1d4. The quarterstaff is a 1d6. Uh, I just think it's funny. All right. And that's it for your turn. You got to move or bonus? Oh, that was uh, bonus. Oh, that, that was my bonus, yeah. And I'm not going to move. I'm good with. I'm good where I am. All right. So, good, good, good. So, um, Veo, you're up. No, you're not. You're stunned. So, that's the first round. I will allow you to get up off the ground, but you're still uh, breathless. Um, so that you're not prone. <laughs> I don't know if, uh, well, I guess these guys don't have missile weapons, do they? Mm, doesn't look like it. Um, is there they, any light source in the room? Just what you brought in with you. If I'm not mistaken, so somebody this, had this, a this, bone this, this that was here there. shadow. Yeah, I have. I did. Light oh, bone. yeah, that's not just shadow, but, um... But definitely hidden. Yeah, it's, you you can hide in there if that's what you're trying to do. Yeah. All right. Let's see. One, two, three. Actually, that's as far as I can get. Yep. So. All right. Whether I stand stand up and move or whether I crawl prone, it's either way. All right. So you, say you <clears throat> breathlessly crawl huh? your way to the. You say you breathlessly crawl your way to the column and hide behind it. Yeah. So, see, yeah exactly. Let's see. Heffling. A few more. Let's see. Do we hit you? Does a 15 hit you? No. All right, so that would be a negative on the first hit. The first swing, that is. And it's definitely a negative on the second. I dodge it. Uh, she. Sorry, yes, sir. 22. I'll go ahead and cast shield my last shield spot again. So that makes sure you see what now? 24. Alright, so that means a 20 won't hit you. Alright, so that's it for their go. Uh, ch -ch 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 rock, you're up. Dr. Rock raises his weapon on this, on this pillar, takes aim at the guy he's got hexed, and uh, brings another round off. Racing is what you need to do. That one hits, and that's um, 15 total on damage. Yeah. Well, why don't you describe to me and to um, Demore exactly how this thing dies in front of him? Oh, well, yeah, of course. I took a little bead on him. It wasn't a crit. So I just shot him in the head. I just put a nice center round right in the middle of his head. His head snaps back, but he goes slump. So we will mark you as deceased there. There you go, come on. All right. Oh, and I still have a bonus action. Yes, you do. Uh, I can do the hex next round. I will do a uh, another healing light on the poor kid. I see him getting all beat up. Medic runs out of nowhere and heals him to full. All right, our little leprechaun looking... Uh, Band-Aid administrator is runs out and sticks a band-aid on you. Awesome. He looks like a leprechaun in uh, full military, you know, combat uniform. <laughs> nice. All right, so we are at the top of the round. All right. Um, I will move here and strike this guy. Hopefully. All right. Nope. Try an arm strike. I got him with the second one though. Kicked him. All right. Since you are in 
uh, flanking, you can advantage. roll that first one with advantage. Then you can roll the second one with advantage as well. Okay, so 17 with the first. That's a hit. And 17 with the second, but I did more damage the first time I rolled. Alright, so it's going to be 11 total, and this one, is this the one you've been hitting on, She? Uh, no. I've been hitting on the one on the other side. Copy that. This one right over here. Just making sure. So we got 11 points to him. Alright. And that'll end your turn. Move, action, yes. bonus. Okay, good. Brother, may I? Alrighty. Uh, which one looks less damaged? Less damaged would yes. be the one that Demort just smacked. Alrighty. Let's see how well this goes. Figured. Uh, I believe in you. Figure. I believe in you. Give me that um, that beautiful D100 roll. Fifty-five. Let's see what we got for fifty-five. All right, your spell goes off, but instead of hitting the creature you're aiming for, it hits the ground at your feet. No, oh, all right. So you lit up the ground right at your feet, almost hit your toe. Look at the bright spot, which is right there at your feet. Yeah, the bright spot is he's just hit the ground and nothing else. I need to actually try to work up an actual fumble chart for spells. It'll work better. All right, so with that, it's um, she, I believe you're up. Yes, and I am rinsing and repeating again to the same guy. All right. I've had the critical fail. I, I accidentally... Uh, clicked it twice. So the first one is a 23 uh, to hit with 7 points of damage on that one right there. Uh huh. So just wanting to see if he's still up. Still standing. Okay, so then my second one would be the crit fail. I'll give you the D100. Um, it's an 18. Very low. Uh huh. 18, is it? Pickle him in the ribs. Gosh, okay, so let's see. All right, just being an 18, you lose your grip on your weapon and you lose the opportunity to make that attack. So it's just your hands slip as you go to swing and you almost completely throw your weapon to the side, but you're able to grip it with your secondary hand before you actually lose it completely. Okay. But it looks awkward. Yes. I did yeah. not look uh, manly or in any way, shape, or form stylish you, you when I did that. You look around and you notice everybody saw it, so... Yeah, well. yeah Sergeant actually cries out, you swing like a girl. Veor, that was your last round of being stunned, so you still have a movement, if you wish. I scream back, you shoot like a Nazi. <laughs> Whatever that is. Uh, accurately about and with vengeance. Uh, yeah, okay. Alright, so with that, it is now the two that are left's turn. Alright, so... I'm going to do... It's going to be a 17 to hit. Um, she? Uh, negative, 19 is the number now. Copy 19, so that's a miss and a miss. Give me an attack of opportunity. You know what? No, I'm just going to disengage. There go. Right there. Alright. That was their there go. It is now Sergeant Rocks. Sergeant Rock doesn't want that guy to get away. 
Elon Musk, one, two, three, four, five, six. He gets his uh, gets here, brace his weapon on the door jam. Yep. He's his bonus action to put. Oh, he's already got the X on that guy, and then he will plink him. Armor class 20. That's a hit, and that's 14 points of damage. Yeah. Okay. Um, that is exactly what he had left. So he gets shot in the back. It looks like that scene at the uh, uh, from the French Connection movie where he shoots a guy in the back, his arm go up, his heart back is arched as he goes down, running away. All right, so with that... It is now top of the round. The more. Alright. Ducky. See if this weapon will actually hit this time. Yep. I'd say it's a hit. And he'll take the nine points of damage. I'll do an unarmed strike as well. Alright. And then that hits. Uh, yes, it does. So that's awesome. He is confirmed bloodied now. She and say, <coughs> He's all yours, my friend. So, brother, may I? I'm just Deck looking save. at you. Deck save, it is. <coughs> That's going to be a 14 on the roll, so it's a 15 total. He saves. And now it is. She's go. And of course, you got the pattern already. Boom. And uh, boom. So the seven will miss, but a night. You get advantage nine. on that. Yeah, you're flanking him. Flanking him. Oh, well, looky there. Okay, Either so. Either way, you there just you go. Well, well, your call. Your call how you want to do it. Or if you want to take the damage from the first, it'd be 13. Yeah, I'll go with 13. That was the first damage you rolled. Alright. So that was... Alright, Veo, you're up. You finally caught your breath. Alright, pop out. Oh, wow. There's only one enemy left in the whole room? Yes. Uh... We I'm tempted to let them take him down since they get upset when somebody else takes the last <laughs> shot. <He's... laughs> I'm just going to stand there and watch. Alright. So that was you. It's his go. Um... Ready, runs like that other guy. Oh, yeah. If he runs, I'm going to shoot him. Prepared action. Ready action. I'm going to shoot if he runs. But not if he, he stays there. Of course, I got the door covered. If he comes over here, I'll stick him. Alright, so... Give me a... Con save... Uh, Demort. Oh, it's without advantage, I'm guessing? Correct. So it'll be 11. Mm-hmm. All right. Let me look up the actual spell and give you the damage on it. I figured for sure you guys would have gotten it. He he's, puts his hand out and he blows this spray into your face. Yes, he blows. The others suck, but this one blows. Mm-hmm. I put out my bellows and suck it all in. As a reaction. <laughs> yeah. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, yeah, I'll use my reaction, right? Because I can, I can catch and and throw yeah. and throw, right? It's a Bugs Bunny kind of. Reaction. Only if it's a projectile. I'll deflect, I'll deflect that missile. It is a projectile, right? He said he spits on me. Uh, no, it's yeah. just a spell. <laughs> oh, it sounds like that magic spittle from Seinfeld. It's, it's like it's that stuff that's not no, not 
no more potent than mustard gas. Magic loogie. A <laughs> magic loogie. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so you failed it. You take. Oh, okay. Well, that's a whole lot. You take four points of uh, poison damage. Am I poisoned? No, you just take the damage for poison. You don't get the effect. Okay. You don't get the. Yeah. Lasting whatever. effect. The status effect. That's what I was looking for. You just take damage. You got four points out of a possible twelve. So there you go. And you get a big lump of skull on you. Yeah, you get this nasty green stuff running down the uh, front of your face. Uh huh. With that, that was his go. Uh, Rock, you're up again. Oh, wait, I'm not poisoned, right? Okay. No, you don't. Condition. You do not have the poison condition. Oh, Roger. There's some poison damage. All right. Well, I got my bonus action. I'll put uh, a hex on the last target. Uh huh. And I'll let him have it with another hollow point round. And. Dang it. Goes on 11 hits. Mm. Just hits. Kapow! Kapow is right. He had three points left. All right. Well, I drew a bead. I shoot him right right in the kisser where he was spitting on my, my friend the kid. My friend the kid? Yeah. Oh, at least for short. Stop spitting on kids, creep. All right. So with that, they're all dead. All right. Sarge is going to go out and grab this guy's body by the ankle and drag him Jesus back Christ, into this room. Because I don't want any passers-by to spot this body lying out there. All right. And then he closes the door. So I'll go ahead and bring him inside for you since you wanted to do that. And then we can loot them at our leisure. Okay. Um, these guys seem to be carrying the exact same thing the last ones you checked were. They each have scimitars and nothing else. 